and welcome to the Trico Livewire broadcast, where you will hear the latest news from your electric cooperative. In this report, we'll cover how Trico maintains reliability by managing trees and vegetation near our power lines. Highlight Trico employee Tanya Mitchell, who has become a leader in our community, and cover our top tips for how you can reduce energy in the laundry room. You may see Trico employees or contractors trimming trees or pruning vegetation near Trico lines. We do this to prevent trees from contacting our lines, to provide line crews with clear access to maintain the lines, and to make repairs quickly during an outage. Maintaining vegetation helps improve reliability in our system and reduce costly damage to our lines, ensuring more reliable power for you. You can help us by not putting up fences, structures, trees, or vegetation that could block access to our facilities. Sometimes, performing this work requires that we be on or near our members' property, but we always strive to respect our members' privacy and protect our beautiful natural surroundings. Trico encourages employees to get the training and education they need to excel at their job. Tanya Mitchell is a great example of this. Beginning her journey with us in 2006, Tanya went on to graduate from the University of Arizona with a degree in public administration in 2009. Since then, she has served in numerous positions for Trico, including Renewable Resource Specialist, Commercial Account Specialist, and Senior Business Planning Analyst. Tanya is also active in the community, volunteering for the Girl Scouts of Southern Arizona, Junior Achievement, and United Way, and the Tucson Metro Chamber's Emerging Leaders Council. Tanya also serves as Vice President of the Therapeutic Riding of Tucson, or TROT Board. We are proud of Tanya's work at Trico and in the communities we serve. Is your spin cycle wringing your wallet dry? Your clothes washer and dryer can account for a significant portion of energy consumption, but there are several easy ways you can save energy and money in the laundry room. First, wash with cold water. Switching from warm water to cold water alone can cut one load's energy use by more than half. Wash full loads when possible. Your washing machine will use the same amount of energy no matter the size of the load. Use the high speed or extended spin cycle in the washer to remove more moisture before drying. Dry heavier cottons, like towels and linens, separately from lighter weight clothing. Make use of the cool down cycle if your dryer has one. This way, the clothes will finish drying with the remaining heat in the dryer. Use lower heat settings to dry clothing and use dryer balls. Dryer balls, usually made out of wool or rubber, will help keep clothes separated for faster drying. And they can help reduce static, eliminating the need for dryer sheets. Switch loads while the dryer is warm. This allows you to take advantage of the remaining heat from the previous cycle. Clean the lint filter after each drying cycle. And lastly, purchase Energy Star rated washers and dryers. New washers and dryers that receive the Energy Star rating use about 20% less energy than conventional models. For more ways you can save on energy in your home, visit www.trico.coop. Thank you so much for tuning in to this edition of the Trico Livewire broadcast. Please remember that Trico is here to serve you and ensure continued service of safe, reliable power. Stay tuned for future episodes and to remain up to date on all the latest news from your electric cooperative. Mm -hmm.